George and Carol, we are live right along County Highway 83. The crash happened about a half mile behind the tree line on this farmland. Earlier today, several local residents were coming right here to see that blimp in the air. Not too often you find a blimp in Aaron, Wisconsin. They couldn't believe what happened next. You just come, you think, oh, it's a, this is a cool thing, you know, this is, you don't see this, and then all of a sudden it just, next thing you know, it's on fire and it's, it's going towards the ground. Hartford resident Hunter Getsky had his cell phone rolling as a deflated blimp suddenly descends from the sky. When you see it going down, it's just like, holy cow. The blimp hits the ground. Within moments, a fireball goes up, followed by heavy black smoke. And then once it was on the ground, it exploded about two or three times. The aftermath looked like a flattened balloon. And you could hear the explosion. Getsky says before they could run over to help law enforcement fire and emergency crews arrived we're on scene but we're gonna have to uh, hike they drove the victim to an open area where flight for life could land burns the face pain on that kind of floor back he was taken by stretcher to the helicopter and rushed to the hospital for serious injuries the Washington County Sheriff's Office says the initial investigation shows the advertising blimp may have experienced mechanical problems before the crash. Tim Getsky says he's surprised the pilot was still alive after everything they saw. I knew it probably wasn't very good, you know, when you see the fireballs. And everyone we spoke to here at the scene is obviously hoping that pilot pulls through. However, they tell me they are happy this didn't happen at Aaron Hills, where 40,000 are gathering for the U.S. Open. Live in Aaron, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4. Yeah.